Hello everyone, this is MadCat and welcome to another tutorial video. So today we are going to learn how to install the replay mode and also um, I'm gonna teach you a little bit about um, how to set this up as easy as possible. So um, let's head on to the tutorial. So let's see. for replay mode you need two or three things you need um, the mod itself you need forge and you need the ffmpeg uh, codec so you need to download those for that you can just google it and here I'm just continuing from another uh, from the previous tutorial <laughs> And let's go to FFmpeg. And yeah, this is the website. You can go to download uh, to the download section. Um, in your case, you're gonna need the Windows package. And there we go. You can download. Oh no, here a build Windows build. There we go. And architecture needs to be 64 bits. If your architecture is, if your computer is 64 bit, um, which I explained how to figure out in my previous video, which um, you can watch uh, right away. So, linking static. All right, let's download this version and yeah let's let's have this here save so um what this is uh giving me is uh, a zip file with these files inside and this is perfect what you need to do is to extract these files and rename the whole thing just ffmpeg the directory and put it into your minecraft folder how you get there well uh, you can use uh, something i'm gonna put in the description uh, you can press windows r in case of windows obviously and go to app data minecraft and this will go to your um, Minecraft user files so you press OK and you're gonna go there uh, the files where you have your saves and all of that your worlds I have a cleaner version here for uh, that I use for snapshots you're gonna have something like this probably and yeah uh, for that uh, you just place the ffmpeg file in there and rename it just ffmpeg and that is it so some people um or even the uh replay mode guides uh recommend to run some scripts and all of that i don't know um it is it can be complicated because it could vary uh, between every system so it is better to have this ffmpeg in your uh, minecraft directory and that will solve any other problem that the mod will have trying to find where this thing is uh, this is an encoder a video encoder this will basically uh, help render a video uh, after you use the uh, the tool all right so now that we have the ffmpeg in place we need to find the latest Forge um, Minecraft. So let's go like Forge Minecraft. As as easy as that in Minecraft. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> and uh, yeah, this is the site my files Minecraft Forge. And the latest version is one as now, one uh, eleven two. And we can get the installer for Windows. Yeah, yeah, that is pretty cool. 
this is some spam that you don't need to uh, click. You skip right here, all right, and then you download this uh, installer. All right, so you'll do it. Uh, you can execute it. And install the client and yeah this is where it's going to be it's going to say successfully installed okay cool good so um, next thing we need to do is to go and find the replay mode so replay mode yeah, let's let's go. Let's use the search because we're using one eleven two. Let's go to the official site. Always go to the official site, guys. Never download from other forums or anything because they might have malicious things. And um, yeah, let's download this thing. Um, let's see. They seem to be the same thing. So let's download this. Oh, it has ads. Uh, you have to wait five seconds okay skip add and let's download it cool replay mode save and just don't just ignore those things all right so this has been downloaded and now you need to run forge at least once so how do you do that you go well forge will already give you something like this forge so you can just pick it up from this drop down and you run it once and it will create all the uh, directories necessary to um, have mods uh, which is mainly let me show you where is my minecraft directory right here yeah so we just let's go to my actual one it will create the mods folder or you can create it too and inside this mods folder you need to place the files the jar file for the replay mode so let's do that okay we pasted it there uh, now replay mode is inside mods the mods folder and we run, um, where is it? Minecraft with Forge. All right, here it is. Right now it is running with four gigs of memory. And my previous video, I show how to change this thing if you want better performance on your Minecraft uh, client, uh, adding more RAM. All right, so this is loading. Uh, and there it is. It is running right now. That's cool. Make it bigger. And that's it. There, there we have replay viewer editor and all of that. Um, I think the settings are inside replay editor. No, viewer settings. Yep. And here you can select if you want to record on servers, if you, have, if you want to have the recording indicator and all of that. And you can start using it. And once you have uh, everything ready, you can render a video. So yeah, that's as, as simple as this. You can have um, replay mode running. Now, if you want to run uh, replay mode video with shaders uh, now you need optifine installed inside forge so for the, in order to do that you need to first quit the game and you need to go to your browser and download optifine optifine.net um, yeah that's the official site go to downloads I always download from the mirror because it doesn't have the, those ads, those, those weird ads, only here. <laughs> and here's the jar file, so let's download that, bam, bam, 
and it's only one uh, mail. You don't need to run it because uh, we don't need the new profile for this. We need the jar file inside our mods folder. So let's go there and let's place it here. We paste it and yeah, we have replay mode and Optifine and now we run Minecraft. So let's open the launcher, make sure that is Forge again. Hello, Skelly. Um, I'm gonna use the 8 gigs uh, profile that we made for the previous video with Forge and run it. And here's loading with 8 gigs of memory. Everything is in there. So it keeps running. It is initializing. And boom, there we go. So now we can go to um, the replay B where if you recorded something already, um, let's say this one, I don't know. I think it was this one. Whichever, I don't know, I have some saved. Let's use the quartz, uh, let's use this one, the tower lo lower level, which is something I use, I did on my previous video. Uh, okay, so. Mm-hmm. There we go. So, now, at any point, you can... Pause this thing, escape, options, video settings, and shaders, yeah, which means Optifine is installed, and you can see Optifine down here, and you can add shaders to that, let's use something like, like, good as shaders, whatever, you can use the, the, the good ones, the ultra ones, because it's gonna render with uh, those shaders, not necessarily going to run the whole thing. Or you can make the camera work first and then uh, render with uh, shaders. And you will have the video with shaders, which is amazing. Yeah, look at that. Alright, so that is um, all I have uh, for you guys. If you have any questions, if you... Um, still can figure out how to do this uh, feel free to ask any questions i'll be happy to help and well i'll see you guys in the next video bye <laughs>